What's good, family? It's Ascended Dreams bursting onto the scene with guidance to infinite love and access to positive energy. How's everybody doing today, man? So listen, I usually come out here with a motivational tone, but the Holy Spirit spoke to me today and said that I needed to make an educational video. So if you clicked on this video, make sure you stick around to the end because I am confident that there is something you can carry forward with you from this video. So with that being said, let's get right off into it, guys. So check it out. If you are a believer, it is likely that you have heard the saying that faith without works is dead. And if you have heard this before, just know that this is 100% truth, guys. And the reason why I say this is because God does not just know us by our faith, but he knows us by our works, right? But we as believers oftentimes think that we can go out on behalf of the Lord and believe in him without actually producing works in the name of the Lord. And if that's you, I'm here to remind you today that this is lukewarm behavior. What? One more time for the haters in the back. Listen, if you believe in the Lord, but you do not produce works in the name of the Lord, this is a lukewarm mindset. And it says in scripture that the lukewarm should be chewed up and spit out, family. So listen, if you are a believer who lives a daily life of repentance, but you go out on the weekends, man, you turn up with your friends and drink and drug and sleep with people, you are defying the Lord, family. This is blasphemous to the Lord and you will be judged just as harshly as non-believers. I cannot make this up. So listen, guys, it's important that we purify our walk with God. We as the chosen ones have been set apart for the sheer purpose of being the living example in the body of Christ of how it is that we should carry ourselves as believers, right? So listen, man, you got to stay in your word. You got to stay connected to fasting. You got to stay connected to prayer in order to be acknowledged by your heavenly father. Because a lot of us believe, man, that it's once saved, always saved. That we drop down to our knees and we feel the love of God come into our lives. And because of that, man, we can continue to sin. We can continue to perpetuate this darkness into the world. But this is deception, family. This is walking deception. When people believe that they are saved for life, man, it blocks them from God. It blocks them from being able to step out into their walk with Christ, guys. I cannot make this up. So I wanted to get out here, man, not to condemn addicts, not to condemn lukewarm Christians, but to remind you guys, man, that your faith is not enough to be saved, family. Let me say it again. Your faith alone is not enough to be saved, family. We must produce works in the name of the Lord in order for us to be heard and to be initiated into the kingdom of heaven, family. So that's why it's important that we are surrounding ourselves with people who believe in God. We are surrounding ourselves with things that remind us of the love of God, that we are surrounding ourselves with positive energy that keeps us in alignment with our Lord and Savior, family. So listen, I don't know who I'm talking to today and I do not know who this word is for. But if you are with me in this video, I want you to drop a comment down below and say, I will produce works in the name of the Lord. Because it's time we start reminding the enemy who it is that we are, family. We are the chosen ones. So because we have great power, we also have a great responsibility to lead by example, family. So no more repenting, man, and going back to the same things that you repented for, guys. Because you will be judged harshly for doing these things, guys. And I just want to remind somebody today, man, that these things produce death in your life. When you go back to these sins, man, when you go back to these old habits or these addictions, you are actually inviting spirits back into your life, family. Demons, entities, lower vibrational frequencies that are literally seeking to drag you down into the mud, family. So listen, guys. Like I said, this message was not meant to be motivational, but more so educational. If you like this message, you want to see more messages like this moving forward, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe to join the tribe. To all my day ones, man, you already know the vibe, and if for some reason you don't, well, you should go and find out. It's Ascended Dreams. I'm signing out. Faith without works will produce death in your life, family. So get out here and do what it is that you've been called to do in your Lord and Savior's name in Christ. You know the rest. Be blessed. The word is love.